yo, 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 what's going on, what's going on, it is your boy Darion coming to your live with another video, it is BRN Media, shout out to all the subscribers that have subscribed to the YouTube page, and this is your first time ever being at our YouTube page, I would suggest that you subscribe and hit that bell button to get the latest news around bad rap and all kinds of media, but um, I just want to get into this quick, quick video, um, because there's a lot going on in battle rap right now with, um, Tay Rock and Murder Mook. I wanted to get into this because um, I did actually watch the 15 Minutes of Fame interview with Murder Mook. And, um, sorry, let me fix my mic real quick. But, um, I, it's a lot to say about it because now Tay Rock is saying that he is actually burning his bridges with Dot Mob. And he's saying that he was a warrior. He'd been holding down Dot Mob for years. Um, and a lot of people really thinking that um, that it wouldn't be no Tay Rock if it wasn't for Dot Mob. Um, I absolutely disagree with that. I feel like Tay Rock um, was actually building his name before he got there. After he had the battle with K. Sean, that's when he became Dot Mob. He already had classic battles with a lot of people before he became that. And people say, oh, Cave Gang wouldn't have been Cave Gang if he wasn't affiliated with Dot Mob. I actually disagree with that too. And the reason why I disagree with that. Because my thing is this. Cave Gang was a squad. Um, of just a bunch of friends. And from my perspective. From what I've actually seen. From um, knowing Cave Gang. Um, not really knowing them personally. But as, as far as I'm seeing it. Is that Cave Gang was more like a friendship. More like a, a friend group. It wasn't a battle rap group and it wasn't nothing like Dot My was. So with that being said, I absolutely disagree with that. But um, Murder Mook, what are you doing out here, man? I actually watched this 15 Minutes of Fame interview and I understand that she actually opened up and said what, you know, about Tay Rock and all that. But at the same time, like, do didn't have to make the rest of that segment for Tay Rock? Like, Tay Rock has been doing his thing while throw dirt on the man. At the end of the day, Mook, you're a legend. You're an icon in battle rap. But you're doing the most right now. You're really doing the most right now because of the fact that you lost the verb. And you're trying to get everybody to turn and say that you lost the verb. No, it doesn't go that way. And I feel like I've been watching a lot of um, people's content on this situation. Um, Vitafly, Sun God. Um, DME Detroit, uh, all the bloggers is talking about it, but it's just ridiculous how you out here saying that the polls don't count. The polls absolutely count. There's no way around it. And you saying 8,000 people didn't watch the pay per view? You're bugging right now if you think 8,000 people didn't watch the pay per view. Come on, come on, come on, Mook. You, you smarter than this, man. You smarter than this. You think. 8,000 people didn't watch the, watch the, the pay-per-view or 8,000 people didn't watch the YouTube of uh, the YouTube version of the battle that you lost the verb. Come on. Come on. So why are you trying to come at Rock like that? Like Rock is he thinking that he bugging right now that the fact that this is actually going like the way is it going? And I see that you say that he was ungrateful on Twitter. And I'm like, yo, like. You call it rock ungrateful, dog. You haven't you been a, you haven't been on that battle rap for a long time, Mook. And Mook, you know that me and you have a rapport. You know this, you know this. But Mook, right now, like I'm just talking as a blogger and as media. I really feel like you're really trying to convince people that you won. Don't get me wrong, you did great. You did absolutely great. I wouldn't be mad if people say you won. I wouldn't be mad if people say Verb won. But me personally, in my preference, I felt like Verb beat you. But at the same time, why you got to come at Tay Rock like that? I felt like that you was coming at him because you say he got booed twice in back-to-back battles. I don't think he got booed versus Hitman at Holla, But he did get booed versus Goods. And you try to break it down to a point like... You try, I'm not say throw dirt on his name, but you try to do something that, like, my nigga, like, you, you gotta, nah, it's just, it's just, it just didn't come off the way 
it was supposed to come off. You get what I'm saying? It was supposed to be something saying you're acknowledging Tay Rock, but you took it and flip it and try to get everybody to turn for you to win. You try to you try to angle it like you do in battle rap, and that's exactly what you try to do. You try to angle it, and it didn't turn out the way it did. And I felt like with this um, murder mook, like, come on, man, you know you better than this. You better than this. Why you got to come at Tay Rock? Now, it's a possibility that y'all two might just have to battle. Y'all just have to battle. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Now, it definitely has to go down because Rock is going off right now. And y'all tweeting back and forth crazy. Mook, you got to battle him. If it's not, it, it got to be on URL or it got to be on RBE. And we don't know what the situation and the status with Tay Rock is because I'm, I'm, I'm hearing that. Tay Rock is not messing with URL no more. I don't know if that's still a rumor or not. I do not know. I don't want to be here to say that he's not messing with URL. And then he says that he he, he fucks with URL. So don't quote me because I don't know that, that source is for real or not. But at the end of the day, let me tell you, man. Mook, you got to stop this. You got to stop this. Just go back. Go back to the drawing board in time to get ready for your next battle. Or for whoever it is. But you calling out Tay Rock, man, that was completely wrong. Tay Rock shouldn't have been a part of that interview whatsoever. It was about you and it was about Verb. It wasn't about Tay Rock whatsoever. But I understand that the interviewer, um, the girl from 15 Minutes of Fame, she brought up Tay Rock. So it kind of made sense to talk about it. But you kept leading on to it more and more and more and, and try to, you know, it deviate the situation, you know what I'm saying, so, it is what it is, it happened, fine by me, but, let me know what y'all think about this video, man, let me know what y'all think about this whole situation between Tay Rock and Murder Mook on a 15 Minutes of Fame interview, and Rock responding back to him, after that, comment, like, and subscribe to the channel, it's Darion, and it's BRM Media, and we see y'all in the next video.